love. I got a dry mouth. Grab up some water. <laughs> Hey, Vanny. Hi, Spring Bonnie. Hi. Hey. Hi. Hey. Hi. Hey. I'm gonna come over there now. Why do I feel like I'm not making any progress? Come on, Fanny, just run a little faster. Uh, okay. What are you doing at the top of the stairs? Spring boy. Fanny? Fanny! Fanny! Ah! 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 Holy shit! We're in the hospital! We need hospital! <laughs> oh. oh, my head. What happened? Hey, Fanny! Oh my god, I'm so happy you're awake. What happened? Why does everything hurt? Well, I guess you were sleepwalking and then you fell down the stairs. What? How did that happen? I just explained you sleepwalked and then you fell down the stairs. I figured it would have been better at falling down the stairs to not do that. Well, yeah, you sort of did. I spoke to the doctor. Uh, he left while you were asleep. He said you're going to need about six weeks to heal. Six weeks? Yep, and he said pretty much no, little to no physical activity until then, so, yeah. What? What about all our adventures and stuff that we like to go on? We're just gonna have to push all that back, hon. Look, I don't mind waiting, it's not a big deal. Oh, but you're gonna be so bored, and I'm gonna be so bored. I don't know, maybe this is a good opportunity. I may be able to catch up on some reading, find another hobby. It'll be good to take a break. <laughs> Are you sure? Vanny, it sounds like you're gonna be more bored than I am. Because I am! Where are you gonna sleep? Well, until I know you're gonna be comfortable sleeping in the same bed as me, uh, probably the couch for a couple days. <sighs> okay. Hey, we'll get through this, all right? I know. Find something to do, or maybe just scroll on TikTok for a while. That usually gets me to zone out. Great. Now what? I do. Maybe I go look in the closet for some kind of board game or something to just keep me occupied. Oh god. Ow. Okay, I got this. Spring Bonnie won't know. I can just walk a couple feet to the closet. Hmm, let's see here. Bjorn. 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 Hmm. Hey, what's that? <laughs> Son of a... Hey! It's a VR headset! I know Spring Bonnie had one of these lying around. Hmm. Maybe I should tap into those old game dev skills that I had lying around. I haven't messed with a video game in forever. Shoot, I went to college for it and everything, and then I got to inexplicably escape all that debt because I ended up in a world made of stuffed animals where I got to fight monsters and live out a really cool fantasy life. Man, I'm lucky. Anyway, I'm gonna go do some cool stuff with this. Hey, Vanny. Sorry, it's been a few hours since I saw you last. I just got busy with a book and all, and, you know, you hadn't texted me or anything, so I just assumed you were okay. Vanny, oh. Oh. She's not in bed. Uh, Vanny? Uh, Vanny? Are you on the computer? <gasps> Oh, hey, Spring Bonnie. Hi. So I can tell you've been busy. Yeah, sorry. I've just been kind of staring at the computer exclusively for the last few hours. Do my eyes look more bloodshot than usual? Just a smidge. <laughs> there. <sighs> so what have you been working on? Oh, well, you know, I actually used to make video games. 
You did? That's really cool. I never really know if those things went together. Yeah, well, I kind of went to college and got a degree for it, you know. That's so cool. I don't know why you stuck around here. You could be back there doing that. I mean, that's like a dream job, just getting to make video games all day. Yeah, the college debt kind of sucks, though. Ew. Darn. Yeah, but uh, I made this little game thingy. Uh, oh, you should see me give it a test run. Oh, uh, okay. Yeah, I kind of used a lot of borrowed assets I found from online, but I made it most of the code myself. Eh, still, who doesn't need a little help every once in a while? That's impressive. Aw, thanks. You're so kind. <sighs> so how are you playing this anyway? Is it with, like, a controller, with, like, keyboard and mouse? You'll see. <laughs> Uh, okay. Fanny? Fanny? Ooh. Whoa, this is really cool! Welcome to the amazing digital circus! My name is Kane, I'm your ringmaster, and I'm here to show you the most jaw-dropping, heart-stopping, mind-bending! Paraphernalia you've ever laid your eyes upon! Isn't that right, Bubble? That's right, Kane! I can't wait to see what you got cooking for today! Well, let's not waste any time! Let's get right into the show! works let's go oh my god there she is she's like in the game oh wow that looks just like her that's so cool man i am so good at making these things granted like i said all the assets are stolen Whoa! Ow! Whoa! <laughs> ah! thank vanny you did a really good job on this this is amazing vanny vanny girl you didn't need to put headphones on uh vanny uh is this that VR headset that not only contained glitch trap, but the toys and baby got trapped inside that one time? And they told me, hey, you should probably keep this for safekeeping so no one gets hurt. So I explicitly placed a note on it saying, hey, this is cursed, please don't use this. Did Vanny use that exact VR? Then I had a note on it explicitly saying, cursed, do not touch. Oh, my roommate is an idiot! Don't worry, Vanny, I'm coming! <sighs> Ow. I didn't move my leg. Did I trip over something? Rags, get up. Oh, what happened? Oh, uh, sorry, guys. Something's off about this one. No, no, no. There's no way there's another character here after, like, a couple weeks. What? What do you mean there's another? Oh, my gosh. Oh, hey there. Well, that's an interesting phenomenon right there. Looks like you aren't so special after all, kid. What's that supposed to mean? Pomni, you recognize this person? Well, I don't look anything like how I remember, so no, not really. Huh, that's weird. I look exactly like how I normally feel like I look. You know, it was easy redoing this theme song since we could just, you know, put Pomni where Kaufman was since he died. Max! What? I'm just saying. This is weird. What's your name? Yeah, Gangle brings up a good point. Well, hon, it seems like we're gonna have to pick a name out for you. Huh? Pick out a name? My name's Vanny. Why do you need to pick a name out for me? You remember your name? Huh? That's the first. Oi! So she got to both keep her appearance and remember her name? That doesn't seem very fair. Do you know how to get us out of here? Oh, guys, what are you talking about? And these are some pretty advanced assets I downloaded online. What is she talking about? I have no idea. And you know what? I don't even care. I'm gonna go sulk in my room. And Kane, do not invite me about writing new lyrics. I don't care enough for all that crap. Well, Jack seems to be in a pretty dang crummy moon. That's no fun. This is a load of Whoa, a real life sensor bar. <laughs> <laughs> Kate, how are we gonna work this one into the schedule? Why are you like this? Oh, uh, this is sudden, but uh, hi, my name's Ragatha. Oh, uh, hi, Ragatha. I'm Vanny. If you didn't already know that. You know, it's kind of funny. She almost looks like if you and Jax had a baby. What? I'm just saying the truth. <laughs> okay, back to my room. Thank <sighs> you, Jax. Sensing a bit of tension amongst your crew. Tell me about it! Does this mean more people are arriving? We're gonna start running out of rooms at this rate! Now now, I have no idea how people show up here. I'm sure the world will compensate for any new friends. 
Vanny's arrival may be sudden and strange. We should still all treat her with the respect we treat each other, right? Uh, yeah, Kane's right. There's a lot of disturbed individuals in this room. Well, this is neat. All right, well, I'm gonna go say hi to Spring Bonnie. I'll see you guys. <laughs> yeah, it's really, really stuck on there. I just gotta... Oh, she can't take it off either. That's going to be expected, these kind of things. Can't take what off? Um, well, it's a little fuzzy, so excuse me if I recall this wrong. I put on a weird headset thing, and then I showed up here. It seems like the same thing must have happened to you. Wait, so you're not just NPCs in this video game that I downloaded? Yeah, at some point we were all real people. I don't want to deal with all this. Come on, Gangle, let's go make a pillow fort. <laughs> uh... No, Spring Bonnie! Oh, let me out of here! This gets old sometimes. Oh, wait, Kazooks! My wacky watch is going off again! Isn't that interesting, Pomni? Uh, yeah? I have to go see what it is! Bye, Kane! Can you get off my face? Thank you. <laughs> what are you still doing out here? Room is too depressing. I don't want to end up like old cough case. Huh? The hell? Okay. My pillow fort! Come on, Jax, what was that for? Uh, is that another one of those marshmallow bunny creatures? <laughs> Who are you calling marshmallow? Oh my god, it is! Wow. You're just like the other one. Ow, my eye! Let me guess, you remember your name too? Yes, what? My name is Spring Bonnie. Wow, this is so strange. <sighs> Have you guys seen Vanny? Vanny? So you know her. I'm not liking this. Someone's starting a conspiracy behind our backs. You think maybe this is one of Kane's adventures? And he's just disguising it as an escape? And he's for way out? Maybe he's conspiring against us. Does Kane want all of us to abstract? Well, we all end up just like poor God, no! Dude, chill. Jax, why'd you knock down my pillow fort? Oh, hello, weird lady. Okay, well, if you all aren't gonna help me, I'm just gonna go find Vanny myself. Hey, Kinger, you, uh, you hold down the fort. Me and Ribbons are gonna go do some investigating. Uh, uh, okay. All right, come on. Oh, God, Vanny, this place is so weird. There you are, you little booger! Oh! Hi, Kane. Huh. How do you already know my name? Nobody ever knows my name when they come in here. Well, you said it during the theme song, so... Hmm. This is strange. Let's go have a private talk about this, sister to sister. Okay, oh god, okay. I don't have any stakes in this, I'm gonna go find Kane. That guy gets on my nerves. Okay. Oh. Alright, well maybe Spring Bonnie will get my message and maybe she can hard reset everything? Wait, hard reset? What does that mean? Okay, long story short, you all are a bunch of pre-made assets I found online. I'm a video game developer. I just kind of threw everything on the computer. Put on a VR headset and showed up in here. Clearly something's wrong with all these assets I downloaded. Perhaps Spring Bonnie can just run a diagnostics or perform a hard reset? I don't know where she'd be watching this from. Uh, Spring Bonnie! Spring Bonnie! Run a diagnostics or perform a hard reset or something! Please! I don't want to be trapped in here! She's crazier than you were, Pomni. Hey! <sighs> Listen, kid. The sooner you just accept the way things are, the easier this is gonna be for you. Yeah, Vanny, they're right. Stop being so worrisome. Just stay positive. That's how most of us get through it all. Ugh, I'm not gonna get through this logically if I stay positive. I mean, it is a good morale booster, though. This is just so weird. I'm gonna go do some poking around, I guess. Wait, Vanny! Alright, Pomni, let's go. Wanna tag along, Zubal? I guess, why not? I fly gracefully down like a butterfly. Alright, what did you bring me here for? Can you make this quick, too? I have to find Vanny! Listen! Listen here! So you came looking for your little Vanny friend, right? Uh, yes. Why is that? And how did you get in here? Well, I got in here by putting on a VR headset. It's a cursed one that we had from a while ago. Vanny programmed and downloaded this stupid game onto it, and... Now that's why she's stuck in here. And I guess now why I'm stuck in here. So I'm just trying to find a way to get us both out. So, by getting out, you mean leaving. And by leaving, you mean the opposite of entering. And by the opposite of entering, you mean exiting. I, uh, yes? Oh, that's great to hear. But listen, sister, to be completely honest with you, I'm working on a little personal pan pizza project. And that is making an exit for these guys. Ever since they started showing up here, they've been clamoring about an exit. I need an exit. I don't know what that is. 
Tried to make it one for that Pondy girl, and uh, she seemed right disappointed. Didn't even talk to anyone at dinner that night. Shoot, it took her a week just to speak to anybody. I was worried she was gonna abstract. And I do not want a depressed cast. That'd make me a bad host. That's bad showmanship. Oh, uh, well, listen, if we just find Venny, then she'll know how to get out. She made the dang thing, after all. I just need to make sure she's safe. That I can do. Put a shake on it. Uh... What's your name? Spring Bonnie. Just call me Spring Bonnie. All right, yeah, Spring Bonnie. Let's do that. Let's go find your little friend. <laughs> all righty, now where is that little friend of yours? Kane. <gasps> hey, are you little rascal? I've been looking all over for you. I'm not planning a surprise gift for all of you. <laughs> what was that? Is he planning a surprise gift for all of us? Oh, what? No, what are you talking about? No, that's stupid. Are they gone yet? Uh, no, they're still here. Well, that's a dang shame. Anyways, you all didn't see or hear any of this. Uh, oh no, the gongles have yoinked the splunky. Uh, you have a new adventure to go on. Uh, bye bye. This whole thing's right suspicious. And it's starting to piss me off. What are we gonna do? I think Kinger's weird rambling was right. I think Kane's trying to play a trick on us. First, about these new characters that show up out of nowhere, two in the same day, both remembering their names and their appearances. Now he supposedly has a surprise gift for all of us. I don't like it one bit, Gangle. It's making me right upset. Why do you care? You usually don't care about this kind of stuff. Because I... I feel like it. All right, Ribbons? <sighs> I'm gonna go find Rags. She can probably explain this better than I can. Uh, you wanna come with me? Oh, uh, okay. <laughs> Okay, well that was weird. Hi, Kinger! Oh, hello, new girl. Friend? Person? I'm in my pillow fort. I can see that. Oh, I have a message for you. There was a yellow rabbit lady looking for you. Wait, what are you talking about? There's another new person here? Wait a minute. Uh-oh. Yeah, she said she was looking for you and then went to go find you. I don't know where she is now, though. Why did you say all like that? Well, if Spring Bonnie's here, then that means she's not outside the game. And that means she also put on the VR headset and she's also trapped here. Which means we're gonna be stuck in here forever! Oh great, you've reached the last stage of grief. Acceptance. Can we make a new name for you now? I kinda like that part. Zubul, come on! Hello, friends! I'm back! I bring a new friend! Fanny, there you are! Oh my god, I was so worried! You okay? Are you hurt? Spring Bonnie? Yeah, what's up? Did you know I was trapped in this game? Uh, yeah, you were like banging on the computer and stuff, so I put it on to come rescue you. You do know what it means when I'm trapped in here, right? Meaning you could have manipulated it from the outside to get me out, right? I... well... I... Oh... And now we're both trapped in the game! Look, I'm sorry! I'm used to this being one of those tackle it from the inside kind of things! It's an entirely new dimensional blade! I didn't think anything like that! <sighs> we're trapped here forever! Oh god, oh god! And there's the existential crisis! So I take it she doesn't know how to get out of here? I don't think so! Well darn, that plan was a fail shoot. Maybe I should go run in a bubble, and maybe we can cook up a little mission and adventure real quick to end the day with. What adventure, Kane? We're already on one. Jax? What are you talking about, Jax? Ah, the bad, bad man who knocked out my pillow fort earlier. I gotta get back in. Hmm. Oh, great. When is it this time? Me and old Watson over here have been doing a little bit of investigating. These are clearly two phony little NPCs you set up to try and give us some feeling of prosperity or escape or whatever. Show us there are more meaningful people on the inside. Well, guess what? It backfired, because I figured it out. You can despawn these guys and let us all go to bed. This is silly. Isn't that right, Watson? Ribbons? Gangle? Jax, I don't know. They look like they're in a lot of pain. What are we gonna do, Big Body? What are we gonna do? I don't know. I don't know. Create something with that much, you know, suffering. Yeah, Jax, you've underestimated my morale and character. This feels a little cruel. <laughs> if it's any safer out here. And it's not, I'm going back in. Hey, Vanny, Vanny, calm down, hun. <sighs> okay, I'm calm. Look, okay, I just. This is such a big shift. At least you guys can't remember what it's like before. That kind of comes and goes in pieces. <sighs> no, 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 something's wrong. No, I can't die like this. Miss, you're still alive, just in a different plane of existence. Is the name going? Maybe the name's going. How about we do something fun, like picking a new name for you? We could do Yabel, Stinktor, Grongle. I kind of like Erpel. What do you feel about Erpel? I think that's a pretty good one. Huh? Um, Miss, are you okay? <sighs> well, dang, my hypothesis was wrong. <sighs> all right, kid, I think we got off on the wrong foot. Name's Jax, and that's about all the sincerity you're getting from me. Ugh, you never learn. 
Learn what? What lesson do I gotta learn? Uh, it's your friend, okay, Vanny? Spring Bonnie? Oh, no, not like this! How about Steve? Can I call you Steve? Huh? Don't worry, Pomni. My pillow fort will provide a fortress of solitude. Uh, I don't know how many people it can fit, but I want in too. Yeah, I'd rather can't get this thing patched up first. Come on, ribbons. Ah! Oh boy. Wait, I don't know if it can fit all at once. Ah! Okay, it's a little bit crammed in here, but this works. Uh oh, okay. Let's just uh, calm this down a little bit. Huh? No, I would recommend calming down, or else I'm gonna have to drag it to the little inescapable void of hell in the bottom of this whole place. Escape void of hell? Wait, can't you can't? <laughs> Everyone out of my pillow! Ah, oh, dang it, you knocked it over again, Jax! Hey, come on, this is a group effort. Uh oh, that's nothing like what happened to Kofmo. Hey, you're right. She's like friendly almost. And also Vinny can touch her without sequentially abstracting. Huh? Oh, this is the abstracting thing? Nah, I'm used to this stuff all the time. It's a little different, but this is just glitch. Trust me, I had this stuff running through my bloodstream for a while. It was a little scary. My old boss was a dick. <laughs> Weird. So I guess everyone's okay then. Nice. I'm gonna go rebuild this now. Um, no offense, Fanny. Spring Bonnie's cute like that and all. But, uh, if Kane gets back here and sees her like this, he's gonna drag her into the pit. We're never gonna see her again. We have to find a way to unabstract her. Hey, Pomni, thinking rationally for once. Nice job. Oh, uh, just trying to spread a little positivity. Oh, uh, dang, you're right. Kane did threaten her a minute ago. She's so cute like this. She's like a little doggy. <laughs> you guys should come pet her. She's really cute. Can I pet her? Wait, Gangle! Remember, I think Vanny's the only one that can touch her because she's just immune, I guess. Oh, okay. <sighs> hmm. How do we turn her back from being abstracted? I don't think we've ever tried that before. I didn't think we'd be able to. Hmm. Um. Well, doesn't abstraction usually happen to a feeling of isolation? You know, driving herself mad with the idea of an exit? Can we just, I don't know. Yeah, Ragatha's right. If you wanted to logically undo an abstraction, you'd have to make them feel happy, like a place of home, a place of comfort. She's distorted, discomforted. She's not right. We have to make Spring Bonnie feel better. Jesus is gonna get all mushy. Count me out. Oh, um, share my best moments, maybe? Hey, Spring Bonnie, look at me. Do you remember when we first met? I know it wasn't under the greatest of circumstances, but... You were a real friend to me, you know? Came to me in a time of need. You, Fredbear, Springtrap, all of you. Shoot, you remember Springtrap, right? He was wonderful to you. I don't know if he'd want to see you like this. You're normally the level-headed one of the two of us, not the disorderly and chaotic one. I just miss you in that kind of way, you know? And I'm not just saying that either. I love you for the way you are. And things are gonna change that. Come on, guys, say something nice. Oh, um, well, even if I've... Been real stressed out about this whole thing. I guess it brings me comfort in helping others. You guys really showed me that today. Yeah, I second that. You guys have been real nice. Just trying to get through it like the rest of us. Well, maybe the fact that you guys know who you are means we're one step closer to getting the hell out of here. Though that's wishful thinking. It's good to dream, though. Sure, we shouldn't drive ourselves crazy. But we always gotta look for something better in life, right? You kind of helped me refocus that thought in my head. Maybe I should get back to putting my comedy mask back together. Ooh, uh, Kangle, uh, I can help you out with that. I keep glue inside my pillow fort. You've had glue this whole time? Yeah. What? You never asked for it. Uh, your guys' visit has made me have to rethink the structural integrity of my pillow fort. And for that, you made me a better person. So, uh, thank you. You two are good people, I guess. I'm not good at this. Would her sitting in the pillow fort make it better? Sure. Come on, Spring Bonnie. See? We're here for you. You should feel comforted. Right? Anything? Well, Jax, it looks like you're the missing piece of the puzzle. 
Uh, you've got to be f***ing kidding me. You two have been tolerable. You're not the worst people I've ever met. Oh, come on. Jax? Hmm? A little more sincerity would be nice. Uh, I got closer to ribbons today because of you guys, so... That was kind of nice. I guess maybe I should start caring about people more. Just a little. Whoa. I gotcha! Oh! 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 What was that? Oh, hi, Fanny. Spring Bonnie, you're okay! What happened? Oh, you abstracted after realizing there was no escape. What? Oh, God, there's no escape! Please, not again! Deep breaths, okay. Good. I thought we were gonna have to go through the whole thing again. We're in this together, guys. I guess we have to make the best out of a bad situation. Okay, the taxpayer has come to collect his dollars. Uh, oh, you're okay now. Huh. You learn something new every day. Well, everyone, that truly was an amazing digital circus. Ha 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 ha. That was funny. Come on, not a single person like my joke? Uh, okay, I guess. Ha, oh, Pomni, I knew we were closer than ever before. Well, I think we've all learned some valuable lessons today. All right, say that ends today's episode. Have a good night, folks. And we'll see you on the next episode of the Amazing Digital Circus. Hey, so, uh, while I was, um, in that whole thing, I figured out how to access the console. Wait, really? Yeah, just blink your eyes in this pattern. Look at me. Okay. Holy sh**, you're right! Okay, um, moon jump 21,000. Alright, come here. Let me just not explode our bodies real quick. Uh, gravity, spin, and spin bunny, set zero. What are you two doing? Oh, uh, listen! I appreciate the help from all of you, but we are getting the hell out of here! <laughs> huh! They just left! I'm gonna go lose track to myself now. Pomni! It's me, the evil cursed VR headset. Oh, nothing bad's ever gonna happen to me. Oh no, my tummy hurts. <laughs> okay, so I see you were a little fed up with that. Hey, Vanny. Yeah? Listen, I'm very proud of you pursuing your hobbies. I think it's wonderful that you're able to find things on your own that you're able to do and bring joy to yourself. Video game development is very impressive, and that was a really cool experience. But please, for the sake of our sanity, stop using cursed relics when doing it! To be fair, I did not know the VR headset was cursed. The note! What note?! Oh. Huh. I guess I didn't see that. <laughs> I'm not gonna hurt you anymore, because I know you're supposed to be healing for six weeks. I'm in so much pain. <laughs>